In my mind, Jeff has a job in heaven. Oddly, that's not the way Jeff paints it. He makes it sound like the third ring of hell. Only more depressing. Okay, baby, that, that was two years ago. Okay, and that and that that was three years ago. Okay, baby, please. I'm I'm sorry. I need the stats on this by three. These by two thirty. And you're late on your Cedro. all fighting our own battles. It's just, I've spread myself so thin, I can't keep track of who's on my side. Dr. Phil would tell me I'm just another controlling bitch. Jealous of anyone with a real office or a life. Maybe he's right. Look, spread's five and a half. Two bills, Portland, you got it. Rick! What are you doing in my office? Baby sis! You can't keep showing up here every time some girl dumps you. What, no hug? No! This is my office! Look, I need to borrow your office for a sec. Hang on. <laughs> yep. Huh? 500 Red Sox. You got it. Already down. Yep. You might want to check the battery on this. It's getting kind of low. Uh, excuse me. I have clients. Like now? Look, I'll be out of here by 7 every morning. Oh, right. You haven't seen 7 a.m. since Mom used to get us up with a vacuum. Look, come on, Johanna, please. Be a big bro. Okay. You're getting one week out of me. Love you. Hey, God, it was such a wonderful session, Doctor. Everything is just wonderful. How you doing? Good afternoon, Mr. and Mrs. Crane. On days like this, I need inspiration. That's why I'm a marriage counselor. To get it or give it doesn't really matter. But it's never a good sign when they don't sit next to each other. Nine times out of ten, it means exit interview. You can make me ask how your day was, but... You just can't make me care. I mean, you can't teach me to love you. There it was. A hundred times you can say, put the seat down. Don't you care that it bothers me? He doesn't. He might do it, but he definitely doesn't care. right into that dress like it's second skin. Being a stepmother to a teenager is like policing lifers in a federal pen. If you really piss them off, they just might respect you. You know she hates you, right? I'm her stepmother. She's supposed to hate me. That's like her job. Mine's to keep loving her anyway. At least I love her just the way she is. Get your stuff. Look, do, do we have to tell Sarah's dad about this? Because nothing really happened, I promise. We're just talking here. Hurry up, he'll be home soon. Everybody says when one door closes, another one opens. What they don't tell you, the hallway's a bitch. <laughs>